Hello everyone, welcome back. So in today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to make this phone bag. This is double compartment phone bag. If you have multiple phones, it can enter it. So I'm going to put you through on the cutting and sewing. But before I start, please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, kindly do so to support me. So let's get started. So this is the material I'm using. I've cut material and lining for the boat. So the measurement I use here is for this particular leather I use 8 inches by 16 inches while the black leather I use 5 and half inches by 12 and half inches. So and I've cut lining for everything. So the first thing I'm going to do now is to notch it. You fold it into two this way. Watch the way I folded this to get the middle. So I will notch this. Look at the way I folded the black one. To get the middle so I'll notch it so I'll put it right side facing each other this way then I will sew it then I will do the same thing to the lining So after sewing it, I, I couldn't find that particular clip. What I did is that I just put the lining and the leather right side facing each other and stitch it round. But at the damp part, I left an opening where I will turn it from. So now I'm shaping here. I'm shaping it by one, one inch by one inch. What I measured is one inches by one inch. Then I connected it as a line here. So... So I will use this, fold it over this way to shape the second side. So before you do that, you have to align it very well. Then I will cut it out. So I'm, I'm going to my machine to stitch those places now. So after stitching it, this is what I have. So you have to notch this particular point notch it but be careful not to cut your thread you notch this side also so now i'm going to trim off the excess leather at the four edges you see what i'm doing now this will enable your leather to relax very well when i turn it so now i'm going to turn it from the opening i left i'm going to turn it to the right side So now this is what I have after turning it. So you can see I've stitched the opening, the place I open, I stitch it close. So now you fold it into two this way. Make sure that the two edges are equal. Make sure it is equal. Now from the pieces side, I'm going to measure two and three quarter inches. Two and three quarter inches. That is what I'm measuring. Not not the folded side from the pieces side. So two and three quarter inches. So I'm going to stitch it. So after sewing it, this is what I have now. So you open it up this way. You see the way I folded it. So that's watch very well. Flip the top, the black leather towards the this this way. Make sure it's equal at that part, this particular edge. So you arrange it very well. Arrange it very well. Do same on this side also. You see what I'm doing? Watch it. Because we are going to stitch on that side now. Make sure it's equal. 
that's why i'm taking my time to arrange it very well make sure that the two edges are equal so now you now bring your d-ring and this uh, d-ring strap i what i cut is two inches so put it inside this way from the from the up there you come down by like half inch before you put so i'll do same on this side that's i put my handle there my d-ring handle so now take it to my machine and sew it this way this way this way and this way so after sewing it this is what i have now you can see it now so you turn it to this side also arrange and sew turn to this side also arrange and sew so after sewing it this is what i have so the next thing i'm going to do now i'm going to fold this side into two to get the middle so that's where i'm going to fix my magnetic lock so just fix your magnetic lock so this is it now this is my magnetic lock i'm done fixing it but at that point there i will not leave it like that so what i did is that i used a, a small cork a bottle cover to cut out small pieces of leather that i will use to cover here as a design so first i applied the gum i will allow it to dry for like five minutes then after that you use that the leather to cover that particular point that's what i did here so look at how it is now it looks very nice look is a design so now i'm going to sew my strap this strap is 50 inches and this my hook is one inch hook so i'll put it and now i'm going to fix my adjuster this is my adjuster one inch adjuster also so then i'll put the second hook so i'm i'm trying to fix the hand to sew the long strap that we used to that i will attach to the bag so after putting it this way now the next thing now is to take it to my machine and sew it so i will sew it here and also here so this is it now after sewing it so you will now put it in the d-ring so this is our bag now this is how it come out this is our foam bag and this is the art comb. this is so so easy to make you can give it a trial and if you have watched this extent and you have not subscribed to my channel kindly do so to support me subscribe to my channel share my videos and if you have any question concerning this tutorial kindly drop it in the comment section i will be there to answer all your questions you see it this is a double phone bag it can contain two phones and other things it is wide as you are seeing it is very wide so guys this is where we end this today see you